Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, One Nola, and today we're going to be playing Blade and Soul. Now, I did take a little nap before I played this because it took a while to install updates. Because I had the game on my PC for quite a while, but never started it up since uh, a few days after it released. Now, this game... Um, hold on. Let's just... I want to create a new character. Yeah, let's create a new character because there's probably tons of new classes. Blade. Assassin is Assassin probably one of them. Utilize agility, cunning, and unique stealth techniques to catch opponents off guard. Using traps and lightning fast attacks, disciplined assassins can eliminate their opponents before they have time to counter. All right, so they give us dialogue before we actually pick our character. So Assassin is new to me since uh, release. Now about this game, you could play it like way before it was actually released. I believe it was like in alpha or beta when I was still playing it before it was actually created to it like a launcher and everything. Uh, some people were like translating it and fixing a few bugs and that took like, I don't know what seemed like years. Uh, what else? Uh, believe that there are a lot of bugs for the tutorial so I never actually got a tutorial of the game until like a few days later of the whole beta or alpha I don't know which one it was but it's been in it's been available for everyone way before it's gotten to this stage so I guess people think it's new at that point Blade Masters are balanced fighters who wield their swords so Blade with surgical precision. Been in the game. Their versatility allows them to both evade enemy attacks and cut down their foes with devastating accuracy. And also, if you guys are interested, there is also an anime based on this game as well that you guys can go watch. Come I never finished are it though. Breathing weapons capable of destroying opponents with nothing but their own physical prowess and a pair of armored fists. These agile melee fighters specialize in counterattacks and grappling. Personally, I love Kung Fu Fighter because you guys know me, I'm a brawler fan. I love fighting with I love any character that fights with his fist, okay? <laughs> Warlocks use charms and incantations to unleash Warlock a is new to me. powerful attacks. They use a thrall and energy from the spirit realm to barrage enemies or strengthen allies. But, uh, uh, Warlock looks like a fucking savage is what he looks like. I might go with it just because of the headphones. The headphones sold me. I want to play it, but let's go to another class. Soul Fighters combine the Kung Fu Master's close-range ferocity and the Force Master's long-range elemental attacks. By switching stances, these warriors can adapt their skills to any fight. I wanted to play Assassin at first, but Warlock just completely stole the show. <laughs> now there are several uh, different races as well. Jin, Wang. Okay, I don't know how to pronounce these. Okay, so work with me. The Lu and the Yun. I believe that's how you say them. I don't know. Whatever. They all have their different classes. Locked. Kung Fu Master's close range ferocity so Master's long range yeah, that is quite the issue. Stances. These warriors can adapt their skills to any fight. So, this race only has access to Kung Fu Master, Force Master, Destroyer, and Soul Fighter. Destroyer is just this, this axes. big Destroyers guy with axe. Destroyers fighters capable of cutting their way through the middle of any melee. Destroyers use brute strength to absorb attacks, pick up their opponents, and annihilate multiple assailants at once. Pick up their opponents is right. <laughs> Harnessing their inner chi, force masters manipulate the elements to assault their enemies. So from the far, loon, torching them with or flames, Lu, freezing them Luna. with ice, and unleashing blasts of concentrated energy to keep them at a distance. Uh, they only have access to blade dancer, summoner, warlord, war, warlord, <laughs> warlock, and force master. Summoner is basically Summoners summoning a cat to fight with you. To control and attack foes. They also conjure and command powerful familiars who will fight tooth and claw to keep their masters from harm. Yeah, those cats are actually were pretty OP inside of PvP. I wonder if they changed it at all. <laughs> Blade 
good masters are balanced fighters. And this race itself so only has female. The versatility allows them to both evade enemy attacks and cut down their foes with devastating accuracy. So pretty much this only has access to female, like I was saying before the tutorial interrupted me. Blade Master, Kafu Master, and Force Master, and Soul Fighter. The only difference between any of the races is this one is tall, just pretty much tall women. Kung Fu Master. And the Lu are just Heart. uh furry people. Let's say that. Kung Fu Masters. This one also is full of tall people, but they're more of uh, dark skin. And they look a lot stronger. And Jen is just pretty much like your normal skinny humans with giant eyes on their females. Yeah, you guys thought I wouldn't notice that, but <laughs> we're gonna go with Jin and we're gonna go with Warlock. But if you guys want to see the difference of the females, Kung Fu Master. Warlocks use charms and incantations to unleash a wide array of powerful attacks. Not as, not as good as the um, male warlock, but it's actually pretty dope. Warlock. I didn't even see the help headphones on her. Masters are living wielding enormous axes. No. Blade and Soul was pretty uh talked shit on about their um, costumes and everything. I think their costumes are actually pretty good because the whole Japanese costumes and everything is something we didn't have. We never like had many games that would offer us most of these costumes like this or put in have devs that would put so much time into having such unique costumes. Hey, at least we didn't get the short end of the stick and get the um, censored version. At least, at least I think we didn't get the censored version. All I know is that I believe that there's a way to censor your own game. Like, I don't remember. I. I'll tell you guys, I have not played a huge amount of this game. But when it first released, me and Hollow actually played, started, yeah, pretty much started playing this game. It was really fun. Uh, me and him should probably try it out again someday. Mostly play most of my uh, old games with friends. That beard. Your face is too babyish, man. You need like a more muscular body. They're randomized? That didn't help at all. Why? Why is that a thing? God damn it. Let's just reset. Um. Body type. Okay, this is getting freakish. This is why I don't random. And that one looks okay. What about torso? Let's uh, raise that up a bit. Alright, so now that we're done with that, okay, there's several different eyes you can actually run too. Just that some of the Jin's eyes work pretty creepy the way they would like their whole pupil would take up their eyes. So that was the thing I kind of dislike about the female ones. Well, the female Jin at least. I'm going to take that one. Now you can put your um, black demon eyes if you guys want to. There's a lot of uh, choices you can do. How about we not do that? Uh, what else is there? Eyeliner? Nope. We're not doing that. Nope. Let's go back to base. <laughs> um, now everything's just going creepy.
Look at this handsome face on this young body. <laughs> oh god. I just can't keep that perfect zoom out. It's Rock Lee though. The Rock, Rock Lee eyebrows. You probably could make him in this game. I, I shit you not, you probably could. Uh, the skin tone. That face definitely does not go with that at all. Uh, let's go with hairdo. What other hairs are there? I try to spend as much as time as I can in customization, just because there's so much to offer inside of their customization. They give me a lot to work with. The only thing they're not giving me something to work with is like a actual wheel to where I can zoom in at a perfect rate and like pick my spot instead of locking it for each scroll. Oh, we're gonna go with this. Wait. Oh, what was the one? Yeah, we're gonna go with that. Why not? Oh, no. Undo. Thank God that is this. I, I got curious and I just touched it. So, you can look at different poses. Just to see... Okay, well, don't do that. God damn it. Why? Is that a thing? <laughs> you can also do a little bit of preview costumes. I always love red, the most of the red costumes in the game. This is what I was talking about. The whole unique costumes and everything. They all just look so good. But it seems like I feel that my character is too scrawny, if anything. I'm ready for adventure. All right, so we got the voices over here. So the one we're on is a boy's courage. I'm ready for adventure. Taya. Taya. Nah. What about? This should be fun. That definitely does not fit my character. For honor and for glory. My enemies will fall before me. All right, some of these voices actually sound My pretty good. My path has been chosen. Danger? Good. I love danger. <laughs> Do you bleed? You will. Eh, kind of clear. The heavens cliche. watch over me. No, that's definitely. Pain not. fades. Victory is All right. eternal. We're gonna go with this My one. My path has been chosen. We're gonna go with that one. Why not? But, um, I think this is a server me and Hollow normally got on. Oh god. <laughs> now that we're actually done creating our character and I skipped through a lot of things inside of character customization because that actually probably, yeah, that took like 16 minutes. Hmm. Wow. Character customization, everyone. Definitely recommend you guys spending a lot of time on your character. Make it as perfect as you want it to be. So I'm going to see you guys in game. Alright guys, so we just made it out and as you can see they already have like full voice acting. I don't believe that it's through the whole game though. But there is a story to the game which is quite interesting. So Why are you asking me? You need to get moving. Use the W, A, S, and D keys to get your uniform. The acting is actually pretty good. The models pressing the escape key pretty decent at its delivery. Makes the cursor appear. You should be ready for morning training, Cricket. Are you still asleep? Come on, rise and shine. I think your uniform is the one on the dresser. Use the W, A, S, and Okay, I get it. Darn it. Cheese. <laughs> All right, so I push F again. Push all. Okay. So that's pretty much my costume. Oh, I forgot how you like. Okay, 
Yeah, you have to push Alt, then drag. Well, you got to hold down Alt, then drag with right mouse. And you can scroll in. And he just looks like he just can't be asked. He wants to go back to sleep. Just like me. <laughs> Let's go make sure Gilhong is up. He's always last out of bed. Let's go make sure Gil... Okay, sure I just talked to you. Okay. Hello. Jeez. But, I'm going to be skipping through the tutorial so we can get to the actual action. Um, there is a lot of story inside of the tutorial. Uh, pretty much explaining everything that happened and everything. But, we're going to skip through that and get ahead to the main game. Uh, as you guys can see, we can actually run. And we can also fly too, last I checked, but I guess it's not available to us. There's a lot of mobility to the game, and you also have a stamina bar. Okay, jump, thank you. Like, it's a strong action MMO, as strong as Terra, that is. Because Terra, Terra did it perfectly for me. Uh, I guess I was supposed to come here? Oh, yeah. Overlook. So, let's go skip there. I decided, if anything, I should just skip through the tutorial and show you guys all the different functions that it shows. So, yeah, a few of the animations and everything you guys can see. The clouds are rolling in. Maybe. Now, here's the part where you can actually start flying. Just well, not flying, gliding. If anything. Oh, oh. So you're just gonna uh, go so far ahead of me. Yeah, you're so cool, the guy who just pretty much just cheat coded across the sky. Alright, let's get to the training. Now, there is a combo system to uh, um, your fighting styles to where you would have to do uh, different things or commands. Did you just. Supersonic right behind me. What the hell, man? You've been with us a while now, yes? I think it's time for you to progress in your training. Take that book from the bookshelf. You'll need it to hone your skills. Oh. So, as you guys can see, here's the whole skills and everything. Here comes your reflex skills, your piercing, etc., etc. All kinds of different skills you can actually do. Um. And there's all different kinds of buttons you would have to remember for that as well. Like, there's kind of a few of them. You can buy your... Well, yeah, it pretty much tells you which keys are which. Or which is dedicated to it. It's a, it's not really all that much to learn. Promise, I promise you. I never seen you in this game. You must be new. Or you must be have been really quiet. I'm entrusting this book to you. Now young Muck is an excellent. There's no way that dog was quiet when I played. But let's go ahead and move to the training section. Alright, we're in the training hall now. Here, take my uh book. Now I actually get my stuff. Open your inventory and right click on your weapon to equip it. Alright, I know you guys are wishing me good luck and everything. You guys didn't have to stop training just for me. What kind of excuse is that? The dagger's on my arm. That is quite weird. So this is Warlock's uh, minion. That stays up for like 24 seconds. Okay. <laughs> Dude, you look sick. Like the look, man. Like the look. But your cooldown is rather long. But considering how long you stay up, it's probably okay. Probably. We really need to get back to playing this game. But your cooldown leaves me with like so much. Oh, where, where'd he go? He went back here? Okay. Alright. So I just pretty much throw talisman, talismans at people. Ah, can't even say the word talisman. 
Alright. Okay. So that's my counter, is my one. So there's a lot of um, counter systems inside of the game. Okay, hold on. Okay, so it's one then F to counter, okay. Wish I could know that if this text wasn't over my face. So you, you can see if the things are on cooldown, but there are certain like patterns you have to like hit it in. So your skills that are on cooldown are actually on the side that you guys just saw on the left side. So just summon it. Oh, he sucks people into him. That, that is so weird. your cursor over to the letter icon and click to read it. Press the escape key or hold down the alt key to activate the cursor. This. This. It looks like you received a letter. You had better read it. Oh yeah, this is the thing for login. Let's spin it. Hold on, I just can't be asked right now. Let me do this instead. I don't know what the hell that is. It looks like you received a letter. Shut. Hey. Hey, you. See the quest log on the right side of the screen. Move your cursor over to the. Ying, we are gonna fight. Shut up. I wish you guys would have just gave me the the hot key to it. If anything. It looks like you received a letter. I'm going to kill you. Please shut up. Log on the right side of the screen. Move your cursor over it's... to the letter icon. Okay, it's just click on your freaking quest list right here. God, I I feel so um, used. You can't just tell me, hey, click that. Jesus. It especially doesn't help if you keep repeating your dialogue at me. You've done well today, Cricket. All right, guys. We're gonna if you are to be a get to the freaking actual main game now. Now that we're done with the tutorial. Might know what to do. All right, guys. Right we're in the actual main game now, where we can actually go outside, fight with other people. Uh, it doesn't look like there's people around me. Or is this still technically the tutorial area? Okay, I just passed something. I think we're still in a uh, tutorial area. I think. Where am I supposed to be going? Did I miss something here? Help. Dialogue. For the first time ever, I'm asking for dialogue. Is it you? What? Yeah, you're, it's you. Thanks, buddy. Where do I take this? Just put it over here. Oh yeah, there's go there go some people. Like the cat? Nice. You look if you're half as good as it. You can't. So I do want it to be noted that some of the game some of the NPCs are rather strong and skilled as well. So you gotta keep on your toes when fighting these guys. Savage. <laughs> yep, that's him. I can tell you're itching for a fight. He's a great warrior, but I'm sure he'd like some help. I love your attitude. Captain is right over there. Help him out. Alright, everything I'm covering with my cam is not really all that important, but if you guys honestly do want to see it, it's just chat and my name and my level and that's it. Nothing like truly important. Alright, we're gonna go help this guy out. Oh, there's a bomb here. Bombs away. Wait, is it? Oh. 
I, I wanted to throw it at that guy. Wait, what? You hit me? You jerk. Hold on. Wait until I grab this bomb here that's mysteriously placed on the ground. Or not. Take that, jerk. Alright, so that's one. Everybody's killing everything, so... <laughs> Man, you got... Dunked on. Rescue the guards. Um, I believe that's up here. I can't run since I'm in combat. Okay. So let's go rescue these guys. Poor stranded person, you'll be alright. I'm going to go save you and take you back to a safe place. Even though your body is... Your body is really limp. It seems like you're kind of dead. Hey, hey. I got an injured person into my hand. Back off. This isn't the right way. That's what I thought. Better think twice. So we're just going to take him back to this area, or is it back in here? Alright, I think I delivered him, I don't know. Oh, nope, I think I dropped him. Rip man, sucks to suck. I think I uh, left you all by yourself or dropped you at the door or something. I think he died as soon as I dropped him. Oh, bring him to, uh, what's his face? Okay. Didn't see that. I don't read most of my quests. Well, I look at him, but I never read him. It's a habit. You're definitely not the guy I'm supposed to bring this to. Alright, um, I don't know how to pop up names, but... We're supposed to bring, okay, there, there we go. Hey, buddy. I didn't notice that. Those filthy black ram. Look what they did. That's racist, bro. But <laughs> I didn't see the quest icon pop up the first time. I guess I wasn't looking well enough, or either it just didn't pop up at the time. Hello. Whoa, Jesus, man! You came out of nowhere. to see you. I'm glad. I'm glad too. Let's be friends. Friends that murder people together. Oh god, I clearly went the wrong way. What am I doing? Talk to this guy again. I'm not sure where the black armor hides. down. Thanks. But guys, this is just a little bit of the gameplays and missions you're going to have to look forward to when playing the game. Now I'm still waiting for a gun class devs. Just a rifle or actual gunner. Just waiting. It's unfair that there's NPCs that can use guns and I can't. Come on man. Alright, we just gotta collect quest. So we just finished. Okay, wrong way. So I believe we had to go save that dude from like the, um, the bandits I believe. Alright guys, we're in this area and there's enemies already aggroed onto me. Now these guys aren't the ones I have to worry about. So my basics recharge my um, little like orbs right below my HP. So Always use your basics as well. I, a spy? You don't mean Master Doden, do you? Why, you must be mistaken, stranger. I'm, do be careful, Master Doden. Be careful. Okay, well, okay, I don't know how you missed me. Hey, no. Weapon is Please repair. My weapon, god damn it. 
I just started, man. Come on. Give me, cut me some slack. My weapon is damaged, guys. I'm Doden, of course. This guy. Just in time, as I planned. <sighs> I hate this dude so much. Because we are about to go. That's right. You get to be part of the next step of my grand plan. Right over there, you'll see the Black Ram flagship. Boring, right? No. I've overheard that it's brimming with ammo. Yeah, this this I'm dude finally. is very annoying. I hate him. <laughs> yeah, this was like the worst idea ever. But as you can see, they have some pretty cool visuals. I can say that. Fighting styles, animations, and everything. It's to a T. Yeah, you can stay back there. Don't want to be up close to you at all. Oh, I thought he just like ragdolled into the air. Okay. <laughs> That's a thing. Alright. Well, guys. I'm going to end it here for the whole video. It just gave you guys a little bit of taste of things you're gonna have to look forward to oh there's like a ton of different like skills and everything that makes the game Take more exciting that, you scoundrels look at them sailing away like cowards wow Juan was upset <laughs> where'd he go anyway but anywho it's a really great you made greatly made game I definitely recommend you guys try it out if you love action MMOs uh, this is definitely a good one to actually try out just as much as Terra is and Terra, Terra was actually pretty fun for me, but this game is a little bit more complicated in a in a way. It takes a while to um, actually figure out and learn and remember all your buttons and inputs and everything. If you guys actually put in effort to it, but definitely something I recommend trying out. So let's finish his dialogue and end you off the one? end off the video. Right, you're from a mountain or something. He's the leader of the Black Ram in the area. He's pretty tough. Well, it's a good thing you injured him with the explosion. He's usually stronger than a Narlox. He'll be back. We need to rally everyone and prepare for the retaliation. Let's win stride back before Guan catches up. It's a good thing you have someone smart like me to help. Okay, you yep, you just you had me until you started talking a lot of smack again. But <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed. Like I said, see you guys next time. Epic poured out and like five seconds. Come on, this is awkward now. There you go. <laughs> Peace out, guys.